First thing we have are some eggs. So I'm gonna make a bunch of hard boiled eggs. I'm gonna eat two to four every day. Two for breakfast and then maybe two others as a snack throughout the day. Some fat-free Greek yogurt. I'll usually eat this before bed because it has casein protein in it. It's a slower digestive protein and it's great for muscle recovery. So I'll have a dish of that before bed. Uh, egg whites. These are good. Um, literally, if I just feel like I'm short on protein and I don't have many calories left, I'll just drink the egg whites. Um, what I'll do is I'll put the scale down. I'll see how much is left in there by weight. And then I'll just chug and then put it back on the scale. And then whatever the difference is, I calculate the macros based off of that. Uh, a bunch of chicken. We got about six pounds of chicken here. I'm going to throw that into a crock pot and just let it cook on its own. Um, I eat, eat about a pound of chicken a day, split up between two different meals. Then we have very, very, very lean ground turkey, two pounds total. I eat six ounces every morning for breakfast and get a lot of good protein. What do we have here? Don't mind that green thing. So four ounces. One gram of fat, zero carbs, 28 grams of protein. So add 50% to each of that. So 1.5 grams of fat and then about 35 grams of protein. Closer to 40 actually um, for breakfast with the two eggs. So that's that. And then I have asparagus. I actually have three bundles here, but this other one is in the bag. And I'll usually eat asparagus with dinner. And then I have some broccoli, which I usually eat with my lunch. And I'll have about 200 to 250 grams a day of both the broccoli and the asparagus. I have an onion here just because sometimes I like to get creative and um, I just really like onions. So sometimes I'll throw that in with one of my uh, meals. And then finally have some sweet potatoes. Um, I've been going very low carb for the past while now. And I'm, oh, there's one, one other thing, some green beans, just to get a different type of vegetable uh, in my system. So if I run out of asparagus or if I run out of broccoli, I have some green beans as backup. So I've been running very, very, very low calorie lately, and weight has literally just been melting off my body. I started off this cut like probably four or five weeks ago. I was 225 pounds. And now I'm 202 as of yesterday. So I could definitely feel it. I'm sore all the time. My energy is okay. You know, it has its ups and downs, but um, I can definitely feel that my recovery is suffering a bit and that's affecting my workouts. So I'm going to up the carbs a little bit uh, by maybe 50 to 75 grams a day to see uh, how that works out. So I'm gonna test that out this week and let you know how it goes. But that's everything, guys. Um, if you have any questions, let me know. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe this video. I want to put more of these out. So when you like or leave a comment and subscribe, that motivates me to keep them coming. So I um, hope this was helpful. Kind of gives you a look at what you need to eat to have a clean diet, to build muscle, and to drop the fat off your body. So um, yeah, like, subscribe, and until next time, have a great day.